My child uses a gate trainer and crutches. Uh, when he's on the playground, it's very difficult because they have wood chips, but they told me that there's lots of games and balls that they can bring out on the blacktop. Is that okay? No, oh, it's, it's a violation of the Americans with Disabilities Act, which has been in place since 1990. Um, if the surface of your playground doesn't look like the entrance to the courthouse, doesn't look like the entrance to the airport, doesn't look like the entrance to Target, then that is not an acceptable surface level. If you've ever been in a wheelchair and tried to propel yourself, or I mean, I can't even imagine crutches, the surface is required to be one of four things ADA will say is always compliant, tile, asphalt, wood, and concrete. Um, certainly there are other surfaces depending on what kind of product the school uses, but it's to provide an ease for that person to ambulate or propel themselves in their wheelchair. And so you can find those at the Americans with Disabilities Act. Um, there has to be also be equipment that is made for handicapped children. It's very obvious what it looks like. So um, I have never been to a public school that had an ADA playground. And if you watch my TikToks, I stop at a lot of school districts. And it doesn't matter if you go to the most expensive school district. I think in the United States is here in Houston, River Oaks. The average price of a house is $4.88 million. Um, and I went there and there was a, a, a basketball area with kind of a cover top and probably the concrete was that far off the ground. And they had two pieces of plywood and had stapled AstroTurf on the top of it. The truth is, we don't make our playgrounds accessible to children with disabilities because we don't care. It's not a money issue. I saw a ridiculous email the other day that a school district, Clear Creek Independent School District, where I live, didn't put in adaptive swing because it would be $80,000 a campus. You're, 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 you're kidding, right? The same swing hooks that you put up a regular swing you can take them off and put up an adaptive swing. They're less than $100. So if we cared about kids that had walkers, gate trainers, crutches, and wheelchairs, we would program and use our funds correctly when we built the playgrounds.